Hey everybody, this is Ollie again. I've got some great news for you. I know how to rid you of coronavirus. I had been asking the question, I had been thinking about it, and they finally come out with it medically. I come to bring you a little joy. It's about time for this joy because we've been locked up for weeks now, not knowing when, where, or if this virus will be removed. I come to bring you a little peace and hopefully a whole lot of satisfaction. We sit home waiting, worrying, and hoping the worst of this coronavirus will pass us by without causing any more heartaches. And Lord knows we've had our share. Without causing more death, we've had more than our share. But I bring with me today something that will be informative and very satisfying to everyone that's listening or that hears me or that reads about this now because it's the truth the whole truth and nothing but the truth like a lot of you i have grown weary with sitting at home not knowing what's going to happen next well i can tell you what can happen next what we're going to do to ensure you are not going to get this virus but if you do you will have the means and the know-how to fight it off and that's what america is all about america is all about the fight we don't just sit down when we're attacked by sickness someone or another country we fight so let's get started you should be anxious to find out what I'm talking about. According to medical personnel, the coronavirus works slow. When it starts for about a week, the virus slows. During that week, it's either going to take you down or you will get better. Now here comes the secret. Something you really want to know. You might want to write down what I'm going to tell you in a minute. During that week that it slows down, you need a strong immune system in order to fight it. Yes, you have to fight it off. Here we go to fighting again, but we're used to that. Your immune system is what fights colds, viruses, and other sicknesses that attacks your body. Now you listen to me good now. There are certain vitamins, here I go again, I have mentioned this in several of my other videos. There are certain vitamins that helps to strengthen your body's immune system. You must not buy these vitamins mixed in with other vitamins or you must not buy multiple vitamins because you will not get enough of the one that you need to help you build up your immune system. And that is the way this body, my body, your body, everybody else's body, fight sickness. These three vitamins are the ones you definitely need. Don't worry, they are not expensive. But I will tell you of foods you can eat to get your daily requirement of these vitamins. Hope you're ready, because here it is. Vitamin C fights colds and viruses and also builds up the immune system. Exactly what we need. You'll need a vitamin called Echinacea because it works so well with vitamin C and vitamin D as well. If these cannot be afforded, here is a list of vegetables containing vitamin C. 
bell pepper, red, yellow, or green, either one or any one, broccoli, cabbage, kale, guava, Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, and strawberries. Now I'm going to go through that list again slowly. Bell pepper, red bell pepper, yellow bell pepper, green bell pepper, broccoli, cabbage, kale, guava, parsley, Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, and strawberries. This is no joke, and it is totally without speculation. This is not a speculative report. This is a true report. They do just what I said they would. And I hope you're listening. I hope you like what I have stated. I hope you let me know you liked what I have stated. And if you want to talk to me personally about this, my email is Gunner, G U N N E R, Brennel, B R E N N E R, Dog, D O G, at gmail.com. Feel free to email me and I will definitely answer any question you have. Thank you and look forward to joy once again.